Hello. So today I'm making a Peruvian dish. It's called Camarón Saltado. And basically it's a satay shrimp. So what you want to do is, um, this is a very easy dish. You chop um, make your horny, baby. Yes. Oh, like yeah, yeah, baby. Yeah. Free time, free <laughs> okay, take two. Hopefully nobody shouts weird stuff in the background. Anyways, so you chop tomatoes like this, onions, and then we got the shrimp, which is the main ingredient. And let's get cooking. So on high heat, we want to cook the shrimp really fast, like maybe four minutes, two on each side. So what you can do ahead of time is the french fries. I, I put them in the oven so I don't have to deep fry them. And that's a good option if you're thinking about a healthier alternative. So now you start, it, you know, you can do everything at once, but so now you saute the onions very little don't overdo them because they gotta be a little bit crisp but not raw so i have another video where i made lomo saltado this is kind of the same thing which i think is a little bit easier because um, the shrimp doesn't require too much cooking um, so the shrimp I bought it at Whole Foods and these uh, pre-cut uh, french fries I bought them at Ralph's yeah so once your onions look uh, transparent then you can remove them so now that I removed the onions from the fire, I'm gonna add the tomatoes. This step is really fast too. The tomatoes are a lot quicker than the onions because once you uh, overcook them, it's no good. So maybe like two, three minutes, that's it. Okay, now we're gonna put everything together like a puzzle. Um, I'm gonna throw the shrimp back in. Oops, sorry. I'm gonna add some uh, minced garlic. Chris. Oh, garlic. I'm gonna lower the fire a little bit. I don't want the shrimp to overcook because this step is, has to be really fast. All right. Okay. So, if you notice, before I didn't add any spices to it, so we're going to add some smoked paprika just a little bit. A lot of cumin, like probably Is it going in? Oh. <laughs> some soy sauce. Use your left hand. A little bit of vinegar. 
You're blocking the... Oh, I'm sorry. Now we put everything together. Gotta add a little bit of black pepper. Can you say that? Yeah, baby. <laughs> now you can say it. Yeah, baby, yeah. Crazy. Okay, and now the last step. You just add the french fries. And so for the last step, you just add some parsley, fresh parsley. Yum. Now over here, I made some uh, steamed rice. Uh, I use jasmine steamed rice with uh, one garlic clove and just a little bit of uh, olive oil. Now this is what the rice looks like. It's so yummy. Mm. Mm. So good. One thing I forgot to tell you guys is that as soon as you combine all the ingredients together you turn off the fire let it sit for like probably 10 minutes before you serve it so all the flavors can marry with each other and then serve all right hope you guys enjoyed this